Hello and welcome to Brandy's Poetry Corner, reading from the new and selected poems of Dennis O'Driscoll. Uh, this one is called Tulipomania. It was something that happened back in the, I think, 18th century, when the tulip was discovered and people went mad. So this is Tulipomania by Dennis O'Driscoll. And who on earth would blame them? Those Dutch merchants prepared to give up everything they owned for the pearl of great price, that is, a tulip bulb. What house wallowing in canal mud, like a rigged out ship marooned in harbour, could hold its own, however secure its moorings, against the ground-breaking tulip egg that incubates in spring, sprouting shoots of incandescent plumage, tangerine feathers rippled with pink, streaked with aquamarine. And who, with his priorities in place, would hesitate to exchange his very home for the tulip that leaves no blood red trail of perfume, but proceeds to make its bed in the tactile gloss of satin sheets? What crinoline gown, what silk chemise slithering to the boards of a lead-windowed bedroom could compare with this stranger bearing arcane knowledge from the stream splash crag in Chen Shan or the snow melts of Tashkent. Who wouldn't want to fade out in a blaze of glory? Who wouldn't sacrifice himself of an altar of urn shaped tulips, a pyre of flaming crimsons, smoky maroons? Who wouldn't be the better for the lesson of those petals? Dropping off like share values, precious metal rates, leaving time to meditate on fortune, speculate on loss. Thank you. That's a poem to ponder on, isn't it? <clears throat> For other poems read by me, look me up, Randy Pearson, on YouTube. Thank you.